Let's talk about a lab marker that doesn't get nearly enough attention in hormone therapy, sex hormone binding globulin. Sex hormone binding globulin, or SHBG, is a protein made up by the liver. It binds to sex hormones like your testosterone and estradiol. And here's the key. When your hormones are bound to SHBG, they're inactive, meaning that their body can't do its job in the cells. So you can have what's called normal total testosterone or estrogen levels on labs, but if your SHBG is too high, you're actually not using any of it. Now on the flip side, if your SHBG is too low, you might have a flood of free hormones, and that can lead to irritability, acne, in women it can lead to something called estrogen dominance or crashing energy in between doses of your hormones. SHPG is one of the most important labs we use when we design personalized protocols. It helps us choose the right dose, frequency, and delivery method, whether that's injections, creams, or daily titration. And here's something most people miss. Thyroid function is directly tied to your SHPG. If you have an inactive or a low thyroid, your SHPG tends to drop. When your thyroid level is optimized, your SHPG will rise, and so does the binding of your hormones. That's why we never look at testosterone or estrogen or progesterone in isolation. We're looking at how much is free, how much is bound, and how much thyroid, insulin, and your liver health are influencing the labs because it really is the total picture. Now, hormone optimization isn't just about replacing what's low. It's about understanding how your body uses what we're giving. For any personalized advice, reach out to us. Our goal is to help you look better, feel better, and perform better. Get started today.